What's going on, you guys? We on Bushido Boxing TV. Be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. If you haven't, feel free to donate. If you're feeling generous, your boy Bushido been working behind the scenes on this body, mind, and spirit. Hope everybody had a good holiday. Hope everybody had a good holiday. Um, I've been working out pretty consistently. Lost a tremendous amount of weight. I I'll have some before and after photos sometimes. So. But I lost a tremendous amount of weight. Um, I'm feeling good, feeling great. And I say by the summertime, I should be super Bushido. But Bill Haney, Trill Bill, calls up Tiafimo Lopez Sr. And he wants to set up a fight between their sons, Devin and Dream Haney and Tiafimo Lopez Jr. For years, Tiafimo Lopez seemed to be very dismissive, very reluctant on fighting Devin Haney. A lot of big fights uh, in the lightweight division. Um, Tiafimo Lopez is... The, the one with the rest of the belts. So that's the main fight that I want to make happen. Hey, for me, look, I got to say it like this, though. Show me something. You had your opportunity with Gamboa, 38 years old. You couldn't do nothing. We talked about it in the original dojo for years, right? We should have subscribed to Bushido Boxing as well. If you're not familiar with the main dojo, it's under construction right now. But we talked about it there, right? How... Tiffy Lopez, you didn't do nothing. What is that show? Just every excuse in the world to not fight Devin Haney. You know, said nobody knows him. He's the email. It's just everything. Everything through everything and everything. Now Devin Haney finds himself at the top of the lightweight division as the undisputed lightweight champion. Tiffy Lopez is now at junior welterweight. And he's going to be going up against Sandro Martin, the guy that beat Mikey Garcia. Good fighter. Originally, it was supposed to be Jose Pedraza. But for whatever reason, it magically shifted to Sandro Martin, which I think is a better fight for Tiafima Lopez. It goes down December 10th, but Bill Haney says this. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options. Senior, you ain't gonna hide from me. You ain't gonna get away that easy hiding down there at the high school diploma office. Now listen, I heard what you said. We gonna handle our business with Lomachenko, and you gonna handle your business with that fighter that beat Mikey Garcia. Good little fighter too. You handle your business, and I'ma handle business, and I'ma handle. We gonna handle ours. God willing, we gonna make this thing happen. Cause I've been hearing you fat mouthing all around the city about what you gonna do. Now, I wanna hear back from you, and you let me know that it's on. After we handle our business, after you handle your business. If not, I'm coming to look for you down there at that gas station and that liquor store you hang out at. You hear me? Ain't got no time to be messing with you all day either. Now, to hear what Bill had to say, right? Now, T. Fima Lopez Sr. said something about a high school diploma program or something like that, if you missed that part. But Bill Haney has some jokes. He wants to smoke, right? They want the smoke. They want to go up. So, so, so basically, based off what we know now, right? Devin Haney and Lomachenko are supposed to be in negotiations for a fight. That's the next fight for both guys, allegedly, right? But Bill Haney is already setting up a fight for when they move up. So this is this is pretty much saying that Devin Haney is going to be moving up after this Lomachenko fight, or if it falls through, he's likely going to be moving up in weight. And what better fight to go? What better opponent to go after than the one that was dodging y'all? At lightweight than Tiafimo Lopez. Let's be honest, Tiafimo was dodging Devin Haney like most of the lightweights are dodging Devin Haney. Lomachenko is the guy that's stepping up to the plate at 34 years old now. So you know Lomachenko, this is a this is a this is the only this is the this is the only fight that makes sense for Lomachenko. So I understand he's going at it, but all these other guys they don't want to say they don't really want to go nowhere near Devin Haney. We're gonna see if things change once he gets up to. 140 pounds but Tiafimo Lopez will they take this fight I don't know I don't think so um but then again if Tiafimo Lopez beat Sandra Martinez in an impressive fashion he may gain some momentum he may gain some confidence and he may be ready for Devin Haney to come on up to see him at 140 pounds I mean Sandra Martin did beat Mikey Garcia so a win over Sandra Martin for Tiafimo Lopez a young Tiafimo will be pretty big um and his one loss to George Cambosis will be 
somewhat of an afterthought. You know, we can't we can't knock these fighters for taking the losses. You know, we can't do that. You know, the MMA fighters could take losses and the fans still love them. So we can't do that to these guys. Tifima Lopez, he beat Sandro Martin, um, which is a guy, you know, is, is still one of those guys that is, is not is, 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 is one of those fights to where he's he's not really that popular. Nobody really knows who he is. But if he goes out there and makes Tifima look bad or beats Tifima Lopez, that's going to say a lot. So, yeah, he got to go out there and take this guy serious as any opponent and be prepared for the smoke from Devin Haney. Now, will they take this fight? I don't know. Trill Bill's out here doing his job to set up the next fight to get people interested in what's going on. And yeah, man, um, that's what we got. Oh, we also got Regis Progray Zapata tonight. Be sure to stop in for the live stream for the post fight reaction after that fight. Um, the conclusions of that fight, man. It's going to be a really good fight. Both guys can punch. I can't wait to see it. But yeah, man, salute to Bill Haney. Salute to Devin Haney and Tiafimo Lopez's. And, yeah, we're going to see what happens, man. Will they fight at 140 pounds? Like, subscribe, hot your boy. Peace out.